I am out here in Walmart. I'm about to do a DIY on, I have a little dresser in my, um, yeah, I think we're gonna probably have to go to like Michael's or somebody. Um, I'm gonna paint a little dresser in my closet. So I came to Walmart to get their paint because I didn't want to spend a whole lot of money on paint and Walmart to be really cheap compared to going to um, Lowe's or one of those. And while I was in here, I picked up a few other items. Okay, we got the paint right there. Honey's holding it. Well, can you see it? Is it in there? There you go. Yeah, so, so I got the paint. We got the paint. And of course, we got more in the cart than we should. But yeah, that's what happens when you go to Walmart. Walmart's a trap. So this is the dress that we're supposed to be tackling. This is my little corner. It's very old. You can see it has some um, <sighs> where it's been damaged or whatever. But it really doesn't matter because this is getting covered. And the goal is to cover over these um, drawers. So, and the paint maybe the sides or something. But I'll show y'all what I'm going to do or what I'll be using. This is the corner. So, this is what I look like <clears throat> when I'm about to do a DIY or something. You see the paint? I got special clothes that I don't mind getting messed up to get these jobs done. So really quick, y'all, bringing this down was not that hard to do, but like I said, this thing is really old. Like I've had it, let me see, my youngest, my son, he'll be 23 and next month, July, and Marla V, she's what, 26. So it's between them two. And if my husband saw the condition this was in, he would make me throw it away. But I'm glad he's not here, he's fishing. He'll make me throw it away and he'll just buy me a new something, a new one. But I just want to keep it a little longer until I decide what I want as far as my closet, um, as far as storing stuff again. Um, so with that being said, y'all, uh, some pieces are like really loose. I got a, I was going to use some nails. There's some nails already in here. So I bought a hammer out and I bought my husband's screwdriver. I got his drill and I got a hammer. Drill and hammer, y'all. And I am gonna quickly just knock the nails back in this and the places where it's loose. And then I found some screws in his toolbox and I'm gonna use those to kind of put stuff in place. So that is what I'm doing. It's gonna get a little loud. I might mute this out, so we'll see. This is not This side is good. I do have some pieces, but it's not too bad as far as being loose, but. Degradable painted wipes. If you want information about this, it's a company that I'm affiliated with and they deal with everything that is natural and eco friendly and doesn't have a lot of preservatives and stuff. And if you have children, and um, it's very naturally, it's a natural based company um, and it has some excellent stuff. So yeah, if you want more information about that, you have to DM me. And I'll send you something to look at and you can see if it's something you're interested in. But in the meanwhile, we're just going to wipe this down. Paint and primer. It's white. It's a um, you good? You saw your mommy? We painting? 
Yeah, he see he watching me go. <laughs> go back and forth like, what is grandma doing? What is GQ doing? GQ is painting. Get them out. Mm -hmm. All right, you gotta go now so I can get some real work done. So I put all your footprints on it. Be real cute. Um, um, he looks like I, got a, um, I don't know what they are. They don't go away. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Bye for now. I'll get some oil on it though. Sorry, get some oil and put on that door. Did your door squeak? Probably not. I haven't done, got to put some oil on it. I'll either do it or when. Honey, get home. I'll have him do it. For the most part, I'm thinking this should go, should go pretty quick. Put this first coat on. By the time I'm finished with this and start on the sides, I should be able to come back and do a second coat. So I'm hoping this comes out really pretty and I don't have to replace it and my husband be like trash it About making something old new, to, new again. I mean, why not? So, <clears throat> okay, y'all. So, this is the contact paper that I picked up from Amazon. I will put the link below for it. Um, it's white and it has it's supposed to be marbled with the grays in it. So, I thought that was cute. If y'all hear my uh, wind chime, it's right above my uh, phone, which I'm recording on. Um, I can't get my camera to act right. So I only bought two drawers out. We're gonna do two at a time. So I bought the drill back out so I can take the knob off. I actually ordered some really cute pink um, knobs from Amazon. So I think the color that I want in my closet is gonna be with the white, pink with some teal. Um, so got that. And I got measuring tape, so I'm kind of measure this out. So first, we're gonna change the. We're gonna take out. Well, actually, I can't use this one because I need a flathead. And thank goodness, we have a flathead. So we're gonna screw these. Um, got my scissors also, and a box cutter. Items used, tools used. So we're gonna unscrew these and take these out. Probably could have did this ahead of time, but you know, okay. It's a e it's real easy, as you can see. Came out one, two, three out. So done. And you know, so we're just I got a bag, plus the bag. I'll put everything in here. No, I better not, because I'm putting trash in there. I'm gonna put them in my pocket. One. See? Not hard at all. Now, it's time for measuring. How does this tape down? And my nails done broke again. Still haven't uh, went to get them done. Uh, don't know if I am or not. Um, kind of seen that poly gel on Amazon and I'm thinking about trying it. 
and seeing how that comes out with the something I can actually do. If not, then I'll just go get them done. But just to try something. I think that's what I wanted to do before I actually go get them done. <sighs> Damn. I want it to come over just slightly. Just cover this over on both ends. And I already see one problem, y'all. Doing it this way, it's gonna be too short and then I'm gonna have issues. So I'm gonna have to do it this way. Cut. And then cut again over here. Like, it shouldn't be that bad. So we'll see how this first one come out. Hopefully I don't mess it up. These box cutters sharp. I might not have got it in the sharp one. Now I took the measuring tape out to measure. You say I ain't use it, right? The things I do. That was my test dummy. Hopefully the second one will come out a lot better. And let me show you where I said where I messed up. Look, look at my cut. Look at that. It's a hot mess. But I'll fix it. I shouldn't have left so much overhang over here, but it's okay. Like I said, it's just a temporary fix. So if I make over it with some paint, the bottom part back here, I should have moved it up closer because you're not gonna see this part at all when I go to put it in the, put the drawers back in, this bottom part. This is the bottom, but it's on there now, so we're just gonna work with it. Yeah, but I should have did better. I knew better, but it's okay. My first ones. So these may go to the bottom where you won't, where I won't see them. Um, yeah. And I have to go find my smoothing too. So that's for contact paper. This one isn't as tacky as I thought it would be. And I'm hoping it holds up on here. For at least the next year or whatever. Might be six months, might be a year, I don't know yet. Um, I'm trying to decide which projects in the house I want to tackle first and what's most important for me. And right now, I think it would be um, the bottom half of the house because that's where gas and stuff be at. Do your measurements, don't be like me. Oh, a DIY would not be a bus, but whether it is or it ain't, I will definitely put it out so y'all can see it. Do y'all have a junk drawer in your house, in your kitchen, where you just kind of draw everything in there? Or are y'all like super organized? I don't think I'll be recommending this actual um, contact paper. It doesn't as adhere, adhere as well. It doesn't stick really well to the surface will not be recommending this so don't look for a link I'm not putting it in there it came out good that's the top this is the bottom with the paint on it we're gonna live with that cuz I'm over it and like I said it's going in my closet so do I really care no I see my pretty flowers but it's raining. I don't know if I can see, but it, it, it's raining. But these are my pretty flowers. But yeah, we're, we're going to live with this. It's still drying, so you see the 
um, I guess the variations and then I'm gonna go over it with one more coat for where I spray painted it like that but I'm really not stressing it because my stuff is going back up on there I'm gonna try and make it neat but yeah this is what we're working with so this is the progress this is the finishing touch on the dresser I had a miss at burnt mishap bringing it in my room I actually scraped the sides up so i had to cover it over with some spray paint so it's a little rugged but it's okay of course my husband seen it was like you should have just got rid of it and i got you something else i told y'all i told y'all he was but now the drawers are just sitting here because i'm waiting for my knobs to come today is monday they're supposed to be here tuesday which is tomorrow so this is how the dresser turned out I'm coming. Um, love my knobs. Hate the contact paper. But yeah, I still got to put my stuff back on there. I just got a few items up there, but it still needs to be. But that is the dresser.